I appreciated this article about the importance of social connections in today's remote and hybrid work era. I know for sure, based on all of the research I've done over the last two decades, that people have different social needs and that people can feel isolated just as much at an office as they do remotely. It's important for leaders to listen to the needs of the people, to get feedback and action the feedback to find ways to make people feel connected. And I think a systemic issue that remote and hybrid work is getting some of the blame for, but shouldn't, is the chronic issue of work overload and death by meetings. Way too many meetings and workloads that leave people feeling depleted and without very good work-life wellness. And it's easy to blame remote or hybrid work for this, but in fact, if it's well-led, remote and hybrid work can help people have a better work-life wellness.